opinion with the besties. How are you? I hope everyone is doing amazing. It is Saturday. I hope you guys are able to relax. Um, if staying cool, if it's hot where you are, um, staying safe. I know some of our friends are enduring some crazy weather in their part of the um, where they live in the United States. So today we have a small unboxing. The very kind people over at DP Clubs contacted me and asked if I would to show some items. And I said, absolutely, I would. I've been working with DP Clubs for a little over a year and I really, really enjoy their site. They have amazing customer service and a really great selection. With that being said though, I did struggle this time. So I, of course I had to phone a friend and I wanna give a shout out to, um, Christopher, um, if you guys haven't checked Christopher out, uh, go ahead and do so. I'll link his channel below. Uh, Christopher helped me out and helped me pick um, at least one of these. Um, the other two I was able to do myself. So, um, yeah. We're going to do this one first because, and this is kind of like a Mod Podge, like mix, m mismatch. I'm just some kits that I thought were cute. Now, you guys know, if you've been following me for a while, know how much that I absolutely love um, retro anything, retro Christmas, you name it, I love it. Um, so I saw this one and you know, Halloween is not that far away, I'm not taking away from every, anybody's month or special time. Well, and I'm not gonna be able to get through this, so this is just gonna get cut. Um, but it's always a good time for a Halloween kit. And when I saw this one, it was, oh, I had to have it super, super cute. It comes in its own little dust bag that is super tight. And that's why I'm doing this off camera. So it's a cute little 30 by 30 snack size right here. You guys, check this out. So with this, you do get your standard bow, a piece of wax, and diamond painting pen. And this is really everything you need in order to diamond paint. Here are our drills. Um, they do come in the good, these drills are always good, but they come in the strip right here. We'll look at those later, but look at you guys, look how cute this is. Look how flat it's laying already. This is just a cute little 30 by 30 retro pumpkin and candy. The pumpkins have a cute little look to them. Little witches hats on. And just absolutely adorable. It's peeling back the plastic. It'll help it lay flat. What is this? Oh, just some extra right here. So let's check the stickiness since I've got this. It's really, really sticky. So that's awesome. We have two legends. I'll show you. Let me get this pulled back down. Look how flat that's laying already. So here's our thumbnail with the item number or the number of the kit. So you can need to make sure and double check and it does match. These drills do not have the DMC, but this is the kit number if you choose to store them separately. And then we have two legends, one in the upper right and one in the low, one in the upper left and one in the lower right. And there's 24 colors in this. So this is a good mixture of color blocking and confetti. The entire, no, I'm wrong. Um, there's two different colors in the background and then all the candy and the pumpkins are pretty uh, confetti heavy, but it shouldn't be too bad because it's so little and cute, right? And these snack size ones are super awesome, especially if you need a break in between your larger canvases, all right? Here are our drills. I'm all acting like I'm done. I'm not done. So we've got some really pretty greens. I mean, this, this color palette is awesome. Look at that pretty yellow orange. We've got greens, black. We've got some teal, some gray, uh, a little bit of uh, the 3865, a couple different oranges, some beige. There's lots, there's a blue back there. We have some pink in here as well and burgundy. So a lot of fun colors to work with. All right, we're gonna do this other little one next. I just thought this one was super, super cute. Super cute. And don't worry, I don't know if I already said it, but don't worry, these are all going to be linked below to make it easier for you guys to find. Right. 
So it is summertime, and I just thought this was really, really funny. Um, it, was, it was cute. So this came in the padded mailer, but it also came in its dust bag. Um, if you guys have been sitting there um, surfing the internet and seeing a lot of these um, pool, pool series um, are coming up with these cute little sayings for summer. So again, our basic toolkit. These actually come pre-bagged. We'll take a look at those in a second. Um, I'm gonna roll this backwards. These are poured glue, so you can do that. Um, this one just looks super, super fun. All right, it's a little 30 by 40 and it's summer, right? It says summer up. Who does not want a diamond painting with a unicorn floating around in the pool? Let's uh, pull this back. Ooh, this is already sticky, I can tell. Oh, I forgot to pull the symbols up on the other one. We'll do that after I do this one. Oop. Slowly. Oh my God, you gotta be careful. This plastic can only go on one way, so be careful, because you could um, potentially ruin your diamond painting like I am doing. All right, let's do the other side. But it makes a big difference when you pull the plastic back. It gives, um, they've been rolled up for so long in the mail, being smushed by other things, so. All right, here's our little thumbnail right here. And this has 14 colors. So upper left, lower right. Let's look at the symbols. Really clear, this is definitely a uh, pixel printed, no, not pixel printed, the other one, the better one. There's no guide circles, no nothing. Picture printed, it's picture printed, not pixel printed. It's one of those, you guys know what I mean. Anyway, summer up, look, there's a little unicorn floaty for the unicorn strength. There's a beach ball, we have some stars. The lettering is nice and big and a legible font right here. Um, it's just super, super cute. So here are our drills right here. Um, they do have the DMC code on them and they are numbered. And then here, always make sure because every once in a while, the numbers might not match, but these match. So if you wanna store your stuff separately, you can go ahead. You guys know how I do it. I just take these little labels right here. I write the um, what company I got it from. I stick it on there. I shimmy these down. I just shake them down and then I go and I staple them together and then I add them, right? I bet you guys, how much you wanna make a bit? Brad's gonna try and steal this from me, right? Let's real quick go back to this and look at the symbols and how clear they are. Look at that little pumpkin, so cute, right? Look at this little pumpkin, super, super cute. All right, now for this last one. Let me move these out of the way. This last one is big, and this is the one that Christopher uh, helps me with, choose. I actually had seen this quite a few times, and I'm always getting little ones, but um, like I went back and forth with this one, and then I forgot about it, and. He's like, why don't you do a larger one? So this is some dirt and some yucky on the back of this, but that is, that's okay. We're gonna pull out these drills. Oh my God, off here, off camera. Holy wow, oh my goodness. Okay, I'm trying not to pee, okay. Okay, here is our ginormous pack of drills. And then this one actually came with two basic toolkits in case you want to work on this with a friend. All right, and I just dropped this. So, and this is, is, this is a big one, so I'm going to roll it back because it's a little bit thicker of a canvas. But I just thought it was super cool. Um, you guys know that I, um, if you've been watching me a while, know that I do like to get um, art or pieces of places that I have traveled to while I was in the Navy. And this is one of them. This thing is massive. 
It is a 45 by 85, right? Oh my goodness. I don't know why I let him in, talk me into this. There's a little um, thumbnail right here. And here we go. I'm gonna tilt you up so you can see the top. So you guys, this is of um, all the same. I had a, samurai swords. I had like a moment, I almost forgot what I was looking at. And they're all pointed down and in the background, you can see the temples and the houses, the outline, you can see the gray sky. I don't know if that's supposed to be wind or whatever way up at the top, but then we have that, um, the sun. If I had to guess, I would say the sun is setting. Um, oh, look at all this beautiful color blocking. So there's a ton of confetti up at the top, but there is also some color blocking and there's a lot of color blocking here. And then of course, all this white is one color up here, and then it gets into a couple different colors down here, and then of course you have your Samurais. There's 24 colors in this, that's it. Only 24 colors. Um, I'm gonna pull this back just a little bit, and then I'll pull it up so you guys can see um, the symbol. They're super, super clear. But yeah, I haven't gotten a, long, um, a larger one in quite some time. I know my aunt would love this one too, but I don't know if she has enough wall space for this. All right. So let's look at the symbol clarity, if you can see it throughout the glare. So um, I will definitely need a light pad for all this darker area. But as you guys can see, sorry, how clear that is, all right? So here are our drills, and there is a lot of them. Um, this is the kit number. They do not have the DMC code, but these are the good ones because I got that dark gray strip. Ooh, this is all pink, you guys. Look at that, that's so pretty. So there's lots, so this isn't just white. This is a whole bunch of colors. It's a very interesting color palette. We've got grayish greens, grays, Darker pinks, light pinks. We've got some cream colors and browns and just, we, there's some burgundy in here. Oh my God, I'm not even showing you. I have it down too low, sorry. Lots of black in here. You guys can see all the pinks too. And then again, the gray greens and the grays and stuff. So very interesting, a very nice color palette. Um, this is also a round. So yeah, you guys, um, that is it. This is the few things that I got. Uh, so huge thanks to DP Clubs for sending this out to me to review. Um, sorry guys for, you know, the month of June, really there's not gonna be any um, post reviews right, or any finishes right afterwards. Um, I'm hoping to start that back up um, in July for you um, or complete some stuff to show you some post reviews. All right, well, let's do a real quick recap and then I'll get out of your hair. So we have this amazing 45 by 85 around, um, kit of all these amazing samurai swords with the temples or houses in the back. Um, you know, Japan is the land of the rising sun. And that really is probably gonna be like a grayscale like sky with the red sun. Um, it is got 24 colors and it's a round. Next, we have our cute little retro Halloween kit, it's a little 30 by 30 centimeter. This also has 24 colors, just super adorable. All the pumpkins and the candy. It is also a round. And then last but not least, we have our summer up unicorn. He's just hanging out, floating in the pool. It's a 30 by 40 round with only 14 colors, you guys. Um, 
This one I think will work up pretty quick. Um, there's, it's not too bad. I like that there's these lines too because kind of to show like the bottom of the pool and the sun sparkles. And it has pre-bag drills. So look at those awesome colors, you guys. Look, look, look. All right, well, that is it for me. I hope you guys have a fabulous rest of your day. Let me know which one was your favorite. Um, and I hope you guys have a fabulous weekend. That way you can sit, hit these links, check these kits out, and then go to DP Clubs and um, go find some more stuff you like. They are a really awesome budget-friendly um, kit or company. Duh. All right, that's it for me. I'll talk to you guys later. See you next video. Bye. Oh,